Jennifer Hudson has been confirmed to portray Aretha Franklin in a long-awaited biopic, according to music mogul Clive Davis. The Oscar winner has been linked to the project since the summer of 2015, and early last year, 17, the singer, actress admitted she was keeping her fingers crossed for the big gig after sitting down with the Queen of Soul herself. It is my dream role, and she and I have met and there are very exciting discussions happening, she told Britain's The Telegraph at the time. On Saturday night, 27 Jan 18, the former American Idol finalist was tapped to perform a special tribute to Aretha at Clive Davis' annual pre-Grammy Awards party in New York City, where the legendary record executive announced Jennifer had been handpicked to star in the Franklin film, according to Deadline.com. Jennifer then gave guests including Alicia Keys, Jamie Foxx, Katie Holmes, Jay-Z, and her Dream Girls co-star Beyoncé, a taste of what to expect by belting out renditions of Aretha's hits Think and, You Make Me Feel Like, A Natural Woman. Studio officials at MGM have reportedly picked up the rights to the movie, which will be developed by straight out of Compton Scott Bernstein and music producer Harvey Mason Jr., who previously worked with Franklin. The project, which has yet to land a director, will reunite him with Hudson, after producing the music for Dream Girls in 2006. The biopic has been in the works for some time and Aretha initially revealed she wanted Halle Berry to bring her life story to the big screen. However, the Monsters Ball star insisted she was not the right person for the role, because she wouldn't be able to do Franklin's powerful vocals justice. The film is said to be based on the veteran singer's 1998 memoir, Aretha, from these roots in which she chronicled her childhood as the daughter of a minister in Detroit, Michigan, her struggles as a single, teenage mom, and her subsequent rise to superstardom, becoming the first woman inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame.